Get girl notice. Oh, no way. If there was something up here with us in this room, or coming into this room, can you touch that thing with the red light on it? That device there in the middle of the doorway, can you come and touch that again? All right, we're gonna try a different way to communicate with you real quick. Alan has one of these DR60s, so we're gonna try to use it. Were you just screaming at us? Are you the one that set off that REM pod as soon as we put it down? Are you the shadow figure that I've seen up here on the bed the last time we were in here? Or the last time we were at this location? Carol. All right, let's listen to this back. Were you just screaming at us? Are you the one that set up that REM pod as soon as you put it down? What was this room used for when you were alive? My name is Brandon, this is Misty, and this is Thomas. Do you remember who we are? If you do remember us, can you tell us, or can you say one of our names? Do you want us to go up into the attic? record another time all right I'm recording now with this device here in my hand speaking to it if you want to communicate with us what is your name please tell me your name what was that it sounded like I heard a voice coming from like maybe even in there You sound like a, like a little kid's voice. The only other person here is Alan. He's downstairs. You don't sound like a little kid. Did I just hear a child's voice up here? Also, before I stop recording on here, can you relay one of our names back to us? I want you to know, or I want to know that you know what our names are so we're more familiar with each other. I'd like to know your name, and I'd like to know that you know my name. So you heard it too then? Yeah. Sound like somebody walking. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you was moving, that's why I turned no, around and looked at your feet. All. all right guys, I don't know if this or the mic picked it up, but here in this room, I'll show it on this camera. There was just some walking around in there and that's where I heard um, a kid's voice coming from. I thought dad was moving around down here and I turned around and he wasn't moving and he confirmed that he heard the same thing. There was somebody straight up moving around in that closet. I don't even know if that door opened. I can't remember if he told us to stay out of here. I don't remember. What happened is there's an opening over here. A big opening? Or, yeah. In, like a hole in the side of the house? No. I guess I'm in the kitchen. Look. Oh! There's something wrong up here. Something downstairs or not. You would hear a yeah, kid. I'm talking about the walking. Oh. Yeah. I'm bad every footed. Mm -hmm. It's not like it was back that way. Because I wasn't moving at all. I 
I was standing sitting just like this. Can I just hear a child's voice up here? Also, before I stop recording, I'm here. Screen. Can you do these EM pumps that we have going to try and give you energy? Do they really hurt you? All you have to do is speak into this recorder. This is a special recorder and it can hear you a lot easier than you might think. So guys, set up a flashlight over here. Obviously. <laughs> oh, flashlight. oh, flashlight's on up there. Flashlight up there. Some cat balls around. If there's a spirit up here with us, can you turn that flashlight back on for me? Huh. Thank you. Can you turn this on while it's in my hand? Turn this on. Darkness. While it's in my hand. If you want it dark, turn that light off. Turn my camera light off. And then turn this light on. Ooh, it is turned on. Can you shut that off, please? Ooh, and look, guys. Oh, now it's going to turn on. Actually, now it's not. Oh, there it is. I gotta shake it in order for it to come on. I wanna see something, can you do it again? Holding it still. Can you turn that light on one more time? That could've been me since I moved it. <laughs> I couldn't okay. tell on the little screen if it was on. All right guys, uh, once again, here in this, uh, in the purple room, we have the 360 pod. We have the Boo Bear thing over there. We're going to shut this door and see if we can't get anything in here. While we go, we're gonna try out the blue room. We still have the ball down here. Hopefully it gets uh, kicked down the stairs. Alright guys, so what we're doing is uh, we're going to do the Estes method. And where did I put, oh flashlights are here. What I'm going to do, actually. Okay. <laughs> Rituals. Technically it is a ritual. Mm -hmm. Down. White or Walker. Walker. I think. Oh, no way! What you, the hell? No way! That dude, just scared the fuck dude, out of me. How'd that fall? I have no clue. No way, dude. Okay. <laughs> Rituals. Oh, no way, what dude. What the hell? No way. That just scared the fuck dude, out of me. Dude, how'd that fall? I have no clue. No way, dude. No way. How did that fall, dude? This, I know you guys see me putting this up there. This was up here.
That was up there. Let's that see if it's crazy. No way, dude. What is this? That's a ball. Can you push that down again? Not. Not. Please? That was pretty crazy. I want to see if you can do it again. Holy cow. <laughs> it's this room. Every time you're in this room, something happens. Mm-hmm. I think you were in shock. I was. I was waiting for you to Sorry. No, it's it's it, completely you're okay. fine. You're fine. Can you please do it again? You just caught me off guard. I wasn't expecting it. That was pretty crazy. Hold that thought. We're gonna use the DR60 to try to see what actually happened. Was that a spirit? that just knocked that cat ball off the armrest of the couch. Can you tell me your name? Whose room is this? Can you tell us one of our names? We introduced ourselves earlier. Don't leave. Do you like us? I'm gonna put this recorder here. But I'm gonna set up- Attic. A, you want us to go to the attic? I could've swear I just seen a shadow on that purple room's door. Here. It fucking growled at us. And again, uh, that gave me chills. Cause remember, this is the room last time we got growled at. You hear it? Mm -hmm. What the fuck? Listen. Oh, my battery's almost dead. Hmm. What the fuck? And you hear us talking in the background. That wasn't one of us. Mine's at two bars already. So, did you try throwing that ball at Misty? Or did you try throwing it at Brandon and it just went towards me instead? Or are you a child spirit and you was just trying to play with the ball? Are you an angry spirit? Why'd you growl at us? Demon. Because you're a demon? You may spook us, but we're a little more experienced now since the last time we were here. You're not going to scare us as easy. You're going to have to try a little bit harder to do it. And if you're a demon, you should be able to do whatever the hell you want. Slam one of these doors. Open that closet door. Slam the bathroom door. Throw one of these cat balls oh. across the room. Answer me into this recorder. Are you really a demon? Or is this app just full of shit? My name is Brandon, and this is... Misty. We introduced ourselves to you, and the last time you screamed at us when I said that, can you repeat one of our names back to us? No need to scream. We just want to talk and communicate and prove to our viewers that you're really here and that you really are among us like we are among you, if that even makes sense. Is there anything else that you would like to tell us before I shut this recorder off and start listening to it? Dangerous. What is dangerous? Chair. Chair. I just got cold chills, like literally full body <laughs> chills. The thing is you're in a chair too. So which chair are they talking about? Who is in danger? Give me a name. Which one of us are in danger? Oh, notice guys, I have these lights on behind me, or the little mag lights. They haven't gone off the whole time. And we're at eight minutes. Mm -hmm. Who's in danger? Give us me, give me a name. None. None. 
But it also said none like a nun. Right. So I don't know what that means. I don't know, ever since the movie Nun, or The Nun, I don't look at nuns the same. <laughs> Did you start throwing that ball? Am I dead? I hate when I ask that. Mm. Yes, I'm sorry. Did I see you? Back when you first turned it on. Did you start throwing that ball? And this is the car. Did you start throwing that ball? And this is the car. Did you start throwing that ball? No way. It said apps full of shit. I thought that's what it said. No way. Apps full of shit. Then it said something else after that. Mm hmm. Who's disrespectful? Listen to this. Say something, but is there anything else that you'd like to tell us before I shut this recorder off and start listening to Kitchen. What is dangerous? I just got a cold chills, like literally full body chills. There's plenty of drinks here, too. So, which chair are you talking about? You got chills here? Watching you. guys what we're gonna do is we're gonna go put one of these batteries on the charger real quick step outside for a second because it's a little warm in here um, I'm gonna leave this recorder going it's a voice activated recorder so if nothing happens I won't have any recording to go over but if there's any time on this at all when they leave it means something happened I'm gonna leave you guys in here to keep an eye on this and keep an eye on everything else um, especially that cat ball back there because it already fell off the couch one time. Um, I'm pretty sure it got thrown off because there's no way it just fell off because it's been up in the same spot this whole time. Well, not to mention it's way over there and it landed over here. Yeah, exactly. Um, but I'm going to turn out the white light, but I'm going to leave the red lights on. Um, I don't know how much this I'm going to keep in the video, depending on what all actually happens. 
because I don't know how long we're going to be down because we got to take a phone call. We had someone to get a hold of us and tell us that they need us to call them. Um, but, uh, yeah, let's uh, see how this goes. You guys got some cat balls in here? You guys got some uh, flashlights? Um, yeah, uh, good luck. Good luck, guys. You can grab one if you want. I'm going to take this out to take it down there. Yeah, I'm going to go grab one. Alright, I'm up here by myself. What you going to do? You got me alone. That's mm. faster than I thought. I was telling it got me alone. Mm. I was like, I'm up here alone, what you gonna do? You got me alone. <laughs> I didn't think you can be that fast. <laughs> well, you don't got me alone. <laughs> that video was nine minutes long, or that recording. Hmm. Bad thing is this isn't a recorder, so I gotta listen to it. <laughs> What is it saying? Nicholas. What is it? Nicholas. That is not what I thought it said. <laughs> it said hey. Ah, leave. Point that way. The fuck was that? Who is she? Oh, I'm Misty. Who are you? I'm gonna stop doing. Oh, I had this in a dream one time. Oh man. Well, I don't even want to hear what happened. Well, if it's the same as my dream, this is the time that we're gonna run out. <laughs> one of these doors gets slammed. Dude, I'm like freaking out because this is like deja vu. And what made me realize that I had this in a dream was a simple fact being that when I said I'm gonna stop recording real quick to try to communicate with her, I'm gonna stop listening to this real quick to try to communicate. Mm -hmm. As soon as I went like this, I was like, it like hit me like, wait a minute, I've seen this before, like this and everything. Mm -hmm. And I went to go stop and I mean, I'm not saying it's going to happen or anything, right. but in my dream, I don't remember when this dream was, but I remember it was a dream, but the REM pod ended up going off, and the next thing you know, I don't remember which one it was, but some door slammed shut. No, I'm like on edge now. <laughs> Make it where I'm scared of that bathroom. Slam that door. Hey, what did you say? <laughs> you see
what do you see? Well, I had mine. Like, eyes closed like this, listening to this. And as soon as I opened my eyes and, like, looked up, there was, like, a fucking... Bloody. Kid. I didn't see bloody. But there's like, a kid, like, poked its head around, like, more like this, looking right at me. Mm. But I couldn't tell if it was in my head or not, so I was like this. And next thing you know, it, like, ducks back real fast. And... Oh, I still have cold chills from that <laughs> shit, dude. Give me the heebie-jeebies. <laughs> Jeez, man. Did I just see a child poking its head around that door and looking at me before it ducked its head back fast? If it wasn't a child... Then who or what was it? I demand you to make your presence known. I don't want to hear no screaming. And I'm not trying to be rude. I'm just trying to be stern and firm. You can do pretty much whatever you want. Whether it's knocking one of these lights over. Slamming or opening a door. Setting off that REM pod. Turning on one of these lights over here. I got two of them over here you can turn on. Throwing the cat ball off the bed or off the couch, rolling one of these flashlights off because they've been up here for over 30 minutes. Just make your presence Australia. known somehow. And I just see a child poking his head around that door and looking at me before it doesn't head back down. Well, that just head back down. You know something says yes. Right there. Mm -hmm. And who or what? You don't see each other. I demand you to make your presence known. Another girl. I want to hear this screaming. Oh, it's like I knew it was going to scream at me. I got cold chills all over again. It's like I knew it was screaming at me. Well, guys, apparently I did see a child. I'm going to ask another question. Because why not? <laughs> Are you a child? Seems like every time I ask if you're a child, you scream at me. Five. How are you? Maybe I meant to say, like, how old are you? Mm -hmm. I am 25. Are you really five? Sad. Is that why you keep screaming? Am I misunderstanding your screams? Are they really cries? Are you a child? Do you even need us for this conversation? Can you set that rim pod off again? We have some flashlights up here too. Oh. Can you go over there and set that rim pod off? 
touch that device there with the red light. Dang, that thing came up bright. Can you please shut that light off? Thank you. Now can you turn that REM pod on? The black device around the floor with the red top? Can you set that off? If you're friendly, can you go touch that uh, REM pod? Did you hear that? It sounded like there was a footstep coming up the stairs. Is there someone coming up them stairs? And the light turns on. Can you come over here and turn on this other flashlight over here on the floor? Are you a child? Can you turn on that flashlight if you were a child? Hmm. Thank you. You can shut it off now if you want. Pretty direct response. What was that? Did you hear it? Yeah. It sounded like a growl. <laughs> Yo, what? Yeah. You said the same damn thing I just said. Yeah, right at the same time. Right, and it came from that way. Yeah. Like where we've been hearing the mm -hmm. stuff moving around. Turn on that flashlight if that was you that just growled. Hmm. Can you turn off that flashlight now, please? If there really is something up here with us, Set the REM pod off. Oh. Oh. Well, it technically did what I wanted it to do. <laughs> All right, can you make a noise in the room that you were in? Whether you're in here, knock on the wall, in the bathroom, knock on the wall or shut the door, in the closet, knock on the wall or shut the door. Make a noise in the room you were in. And if you're in this room with us, you can even set off the REM pod. That's a noise. Oh, so, uh, but the last time we were here and what we've gone through, the last time we were here, we have reasonable suspicion to believe that there is something not so nice in here. Is that you? Are you the something that's not so nice in here? I keep on sounding like I'm hearing footsteps coming up the stairs. Put the rim pot at the very beginning. Yeah, I was about to say, you hear that? Maybe that's the noise you wanted to hear. Of where they were at? Mm-hmm. In the damn bathroom. If you're in the bathroom, can you, uh, come out of there and set this REM pod off? Make it go crazy. The closer you get to it, the faster and louder it is. I heard that too. Sounds like it's literally walking out. Mm hmm. Hmm. Must be walking out. Now, touch that room pod. Oh. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> that was bright. Can you hold on to the antenna? Hold on to it. Ooh. That's dope. I don't know. Sounds like it. Yeah, this is getting mad creepy. Mm -hmm. Well, we don't know exactly what is going on, <laughs> but we're kind of like backed up in the corner over here because it sounds like there's footsteps and stuff coming from, you know, going coming up the stairs, back in there in that closet in the bathroom like surrounding us. yeah it's like we're surrounded and the only people here right now is alan and uh well and my dad but my dad's outside taking a nap in the car and alan is all the way downstairs oh that was definitely the stairs mm -hmm. dude this is sketchy because now i'm starting to remember the last time that we were here yeah, so. and we'd have to go down them stairs that we hear them at. Right. I don't know, man, this place is creepy. And the thing is, this place is one of them places that you can go 
like a couple hours won't get nothing and then it'd be like zero to 100 like real quick and then nothing for another hour or so and then you least expect it it sounds like everything's coming from everywhere <laughs> Ooh. Hold on tighter to it. Make all them lights go off. Like this. Do this. See? Do that. Getting closer. There you go. You're doing good. Keep on going. You took your flashlight. If you want it back. Set off one of these cat balls or turn on that other flashlight and I'll put this flashlight back exactly where it was, I promise. Also guys, that's not me being a jerk. What was that? Dude, what the heck? It was right from over there. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Anyways, that's not me being a jerk. Um, I'm just trying to trigger response out of them. They keep messing with the flashlight that was on the couch by the teddy bear. Um, that's the only thing to mess with other than the REM pod from time to time. And uh, I'm trying to get them to mess with something else. So it's almost like a, a little kid realistically. Sometimes you gotta take away something just to get them to do something. Um, there you and go. Keep it set doing the it. REM pod off again. But I want it to set something else off like the other flashlight or one of the cat balls so I know they were actually talking to something. Some of these places, a lot of these places, actually the ghosts seem to favor one flashlight over the other for whatever reason. The only place that we've ever been able to actually get the spirits to go along with this flashlight is yes, this flashlight is no, is the Ashmore Estates in the boiler room. Other than that, We've gotten tons of flashlight activity everywhere else, but nothing so far compares to the boiler room at Ashmore Estates. That was super intelligent responses. Looks like it came up the stairs and touched it. That's me. No, oh, maybe it wasn't. Cause see, I'm touching it again. That was pretty good. But if you hold on to it tighter. Ooh. Then you're going to make all them lights go off like he showed you. There. Alright. No, I mean, I'm still kind of shaking up from that because I heard something like knocking here. Mm -hmm. Turn your flashlight off real quick. There was just a knock on the fucking wall, dude. Right behind you. Y'all need to chill that shit out. Oh! Oh! You caught it on camera. God, man. Got it already. And I heard that knock again. Yep. Alright. We're gonna take another break <laughs> while we gather our bearings for a second because we are tired. And uh, just in case something walks up uh, these stairs. I'm gonna leave you guys up here watching it. That we just heard creaking on. Next thing you know, I'm driving. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Is there anyone in the house that would like to speak with us? <laughs> it said slap them. <laughs> <laughs> Is there anyone in this room that would like to speak with us? I'm not going to tell you that. Just accept it. Who's over there setting off that rim pod? Are you going to talk with us? We would like to communicate with you. Turn back. We'll be leaving here shortly. Will you speak with us before we leave? I understand. What's your name? How old are you? Can you give me a number? 
Are you not going to talk with us? He just tried saying something, but I didn't understand it. Try your hardest to talk to him through that device. If she could hear me, she would jump. Yeah, I probably would. Well, that's some good news. I came here to tell you that. To tell me what? I killed someone. Who did you kill? Are you not going to tell me? Is there anyone up here with us right now? Did this loud sound scare you? Well guys, we are finished with our investigation. We're packing up and we're heading back. I say it's pretty successful for our second time being here. We really wanted to visit this place again because we've had quite a few of you guys ask us if we plan on going back. I feel like we definitely got more stuff this time. All right, guys, see you on the next one.